You are hereby called to serve as a missionary of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. This is the biggest moment in a young woman's life. You are signed to live in the New Zealand. <laughs> Every month, thousands of young people are called to serve as missionaries for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. Would you like to hear about the actual Book of Mormon? Aged between 18 and 25, they're all about to join the largest full-time missionary force of any church. Hello, 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 everyone! There are 400 possible destinations. Brazil. Taiwan, Mexico. Some are more well-known than others. Massey. What? Manchester. Manchester, Manchester. Oh. First stop for missionaries bound for the UK is a training centre just 20 miles from Manchester in Chorley, an area with more Mormons than anywhere else in Europe. It's good to see them and to start their missions. It's an exciting time. I wouldn't be able to come here without my mom. That's true. <laughs> my mom takes good care of me. The church has allowed unprecedented access to the training here and to the toughest first three months of missionary work. We use Instagram and Facebook. Today we're going to look at how can we actually be more normal and natural. And the goal is to meet these people in person. In an increasingly secular Britain, both missionaries and other young Mormons face many challenges. We really value waiting. Knowing that you're not going to have sex. Just a whole load of temptations can come. And it's tougher than ever to sign up new converts. I had these doubts about the church and its structure. This is the first week that I've really been like, I miss home. It's too late to go back now. So what does it take to succeed? We look like salesmen, to be honest. You just go up to random people, you feel really rude. It's just a small portion of their lives, but it prepares them for all of life challenges. It's a little bit uncomfortable, but you just gotta put yourself out there. 